It's a £42 billion transport project that's been hailed as the future for business and employment across our region. But could the government's proposed flagship HS2 high-speed rail link between London and the West Midlands be derailed by a rare species of bat? Well, conservationists say the route through Buckinghamshire will impact the creature's habitat. But the company in charge of the project says the animals won't be harmed. With more now, Kerry Johnston. It's a high-tech vision of the future which could become a reality, slashing journey times between London and the West Midlands whilst creating jobs and prosperity. Wildlife campaigners, though, say the line will run roughshod over important natural habitats of protected species between Bicester and Aylesbury. HS2 will clip two of our nature reserves in this area, um, but it will also run through an area where there's a particularly rare species, a bat, one of Britain's rarest mammals, called the Beckstein's bat, and we're worried about it dividing up the colony of bats in this area. Uh, on this site, we're expecting things like orchids to go. Um, there are hair streak butterflies, which are a particular specialty of this part of the world. Um, some of their habitat will be lost. Uh, here on this site, we have turtle doves uh, occasionally in the scrub, and unfortunately their habitat is likely to go with the railway as well. But HS2 Limited, in charge of the project, say they've considered the bat's welfare, saying... We are proposing to build a series of bridges and underpasses to protect flight paths of Beckstein's bats where they are present along the HS2 route, which will help to maintain a healthy population. Bats aside, it's the human cost which others who are opposed to the scheme say is even more important. People are really angry at what's being done to Buckinghamshire, how their villages, their towns, their communities are being affected, and everybody's determined to make sure that they stay involved right the way through this process. A process which has already begun, with the House of Commons HS2 Select Committee already hearing petitions for and against the scheme on behalf of residents, businesses and bats. Kerry Johnston, ITV News.